Hello, I'm introducing welcome back to Hearts of Iron 4 as Mexico. Right, I believe the time is nigh that we need to build some more uh, military police. Sadly, we do need to get some more military police going. And because of that, what I think we'll do is change the resistance to gentlest. That way the resistance will be a little bit less. And there. Yeah, I think that's that's about right. Right, we might actually need to build some more uh, MPs as well. So we're gonna add some MPs on the end. Uh, wait until we've got twelve. Set the location to uh, here. I will click to assign you to blue. Right. And I only want to build 12. Just stop it after 12. Can't really afford much more manpower. I mean, that's a good, what, 60k or something as it is? I, I can't really afford to go beyond that. Sadly. Right. Caribbean Sea, East Coast. Yeah, I've got supply problems over here. That's fine for now. Uh, we should probably also extend our supply lines with some naval bases. Yeah, so you need to be a 10. You need to be a 10. And we'll put you to the top. There we go. Right. We are almost ready to invade. Very, very close. You're invading over there. You're invading over here. Invading over here. You're pushing through up there. Uh, where's the other invasion? There we go. And you're pretty much ready to go. So, let's get our navy. Nope, nope, nope. Just here. Tasman Sea. Come on, we'll have knowledge of it soon. Oh, hello. Yeah, yeah, I know you're trying to invade in Eastern Canada, that's fine. New Guinea, blah, 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 blah. Where is that naval battle that you indicated? Oh, okay. There we go. Iran, join me, Mores. So you need to declare war on Iran. Doing a good job there. Come on, Soviet Union. If you really can't pull that off. They really aren't making much headway at all, are they? Making a little bit of headway into Afghanistan. That's all mountains, so it's always going to be a tough fight. Are we ready to go yet? We are. Although, that said, there is actually a naval engagement. Remember that our carriers don't do anything. Right now, they don't actually have any aircraft on them. We killed three, uh, ten destroyers for our three. That's good so far. Right. Send you off. Send you off. Don't get killed on the way. Oh, hello there. They're actually defending this. We should have it down, though. Okay, no transport ships got caught. That said, we are getting some sea experience here with this fight, which I'm pleased about. They might actually outgun us because we don't have any carriers. I think that might be the last big chunk of Australia. They've still got this, which is actually now their capital. No, oh, poor Australia. Um, I'm pretty tempted to actually invade that just because it exists. 
Let's do it. Right, they have ports over here, and we'll use those to invade the rest of the app. Oh god, actually, that's separate. Huh. That's annoying. Well, we'll try and grab the island. And then we're going to have to do a separate invasion over there. I guess purple can do it once they grab the last bit over here on, uh, what's this, New Guinea? Ooh. An actual fight. Interesting. I think what we're going to have to do is try and claim this port here. Oh, actually, we, we managed to get... How? We got Auckland? I have no idea how we managed that. We did. And I am surprised. Right. We will give you bombardment bonus. Because I think we need it. You, um... To be honest, you probably need the New Zealand. Okay, here we go. Shore bombardment. We're still at the intel bonus. Keep it up. You got this. I only need a second fleet to be able to do all the things I need down here at once. Come on! Ninety-three. You. Come down here. Oh, I forgot the support here. We could have just got that. Instead of worrying. Oh well, we worried. I cannot cross here. Blocked by an enemy fleet. Interesting. I could attack across a minute ago. Doctrine effort. Um... Not quite yet. I think it's equipment. Mm. Yeah, equipment. Okay, let's at least grab one of you. Go and capture Christchurch. Lovely place, Christchurch. Still cannot cross. Well, let's do what we need to do. Murder everything. Great. Subs are doing what they need to do as well. Purple. Here's your invasion plan. That should be a fairly easy one to do. Mm. 
New Zealand capitulated. Fully, actually. Well, sweet. That, that solves my problems. Which unit are you? This one's 15. Okay. Yeah, just completely and utterly capitulated. Hey. Now the question is, do I bother with these islands here? Because there's a big benefit to actually doing these islands. And that is that uh, the United Kingdom can't use them as naval bases anymore. So it'll have problems hitting us. Let's got one over there anyway. Oh, it's the Galapagos to hit. Um, which severely limit their strike range. That can be your job once you've grabbed these. You can base out of here and grab those. I don't think that'll be too much of an issue for you. You, on the other hand... I've got a new job for you. Actually, let's grab that. I'll probably want you to invade um, down here into India, but we'll probably end up doing it from like here or somewhere so there's only one sea zone to go across. So for now, if you could all, if I tell them to congregate there, they might not be able to cross the sea zone. I'll just give you a garrison area order. Right. Navy. Convoy escort. There we go. And you're going to be another 20 days. Ugh. Okay, there we go. The great thing about sinking the troops in the convoys themselves is that we don't have to worry about them getting away, etc. and reinforcing the United Kingdom with their manpower. Yeah, they're actually going to defend this pretty decently. Now, there's only one port to get to. So, straight up. It's going to be a tough fight. I'm actually going to edit your order. I don't want you going to this island anymore. I think we got to hit him here. We need more units on that island. How long till you're ready? 10 days. You know what? I'm going to wait the 10 days. Oh, and you're traveling through jungle, so it'll take you ages to get there. Right, yep, keep hitting me. Stay there. I want to hit from multiple angles. Are you ready yet? Three days. I know why this is. Some divisions are still walking over here because they're very slow. Ready. Right. And we just got the naval carrier bomber. Carrier naval bomber. Yes. We don't need that many, so that should be fine. Um, we'll get a little bit more close air support. We'll get a little bit more fighters. We will up the motorized a little bit. And we should be good. Yeah. Okay. 
Now the question is, what do we go for next? I really don't want to go for naval bombers, but we have to go for weapons three. Just too good. Also want to go for nuclear at some stage. Come on. Last holdouts of Australia. Mechanized equipment. We can reduce that ahead of time, but eh. Support weapons. I really wish I had five slots for research. Four is just so slow. Okay, let them get their organization back. They've only just landed. Should be happy on that front line. Fighter carrier two. Lovely. And we will stop working towards naval two. Now the big question is fighter carrier two, fighter carrier two, fighter carrier two. Production, there we go. We didn't previously have a fighter carrier, so. Carrier Fight 2. There we go. Right. Lack of supply. Good. Liberia joining it. Oh my god, I'm shaking my boots. What are they going to do to us? They're going to murder us all. Oh no, they've joined the war. We're done for. <gasps> right. Which is the smallest unit? Technically that five. You know what? There we go. Now, five. I want you to do an invasion of here. Seven, on the other hand. I've got several jobs for you. One, do that. Two, do that. And that should capture us the entire island. And that should be the last bit of Australia, I think. Ah, oh, it looks a lot better in my colours. Then I do think we'll probably get rid of these. Just with the units we've got over here. Right. Now, this gives us our opportunity. We do not need you over here. We need you over here. Over here. And, yeah, we'll cover the Gulf of Thailand. Why not? And we should be able to do an invasion. Hello, convoys. Welcome, welcome. We're not producing any more submarines. Oh, wait, our submarines are up here, aren't they? There we go. Uh, new uh, commander. Portifo Bustamente. Sure. It's a strong name. Um, we'll leave you in port for now, just so you can get your... Ooh. They're getting up to capacity. Oh, my God. We'll probably lay off the carriers soon and just uh, produce one rather than two blocks of carriers. Are we ready to go? Yes. Some divisions have not reached the same position. Oh, wrong one. Yes. Go. Go. We're on. The invasion has begun. Psyched. Right, you're already at a port. You're moving to a port. There we go. Looks like we should be good. 
Oh my god, we even got Singapore? Wow, okay. Didn't do too badly, did we? Um... I'm being cautious about not producing two fronts yet. Bam. That's it. Now, are you... Yeah, you're a general. We'll have to fiddle around with who's on what army, etc. However, this 12. There you go. Extend that. Then we'll start advancing. Oh, 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 wait. There we go. And, yeah, do it aggressively. Meanwhile... Yeah, you should be doing that order. I don't know why you haven't. Yeah, you're traveling. Okay. Um, you have managed to grab the territory I wanted. Not actually grabbed Rangoon or anything, but, uh, you know, getting close-ish. Once you get there, we'll send you a batch of reinforcements as well. It's actually all coming together-ish. Ish. Uh, what do I want to grab next? Cast effort. Yeah, why not? And more British sailors. Um, let's check on the details. They are service by requirement. So we're doing vaguely better than them. It oh, Italy's almost gone. Germany's almost gone. Well, Italy is almost gone. Germany is not almost gone. However, they've lost so much land. Like, this this is where the Maginot Line is. Once this starts happening, it's it's the end. It's not the beginning of the end. It is actually the end. is pretty much here. Look at that. Hint of Poland. Poland's doing really well. Ooh. Poland, are you actually finally at war with Russia? I believe you are. Where's the actual Russian flag? I keep missing it in all these flags over here. Oh, there it is. Yeah, so you're actually fighting the Russians. You know what? You've actually taken land off of them. Impressive. <sighs> anyway, I've been Andrew If you enjoyed, please like, not subscribe. Please consider subscribing. We are in with the invasion, and it is looking like a mighty fine day indeed. Until next time, stay shiny.